Welcome back to Infigyan my dear friends. Today in this video we are going to take up one very interesting system of equations. Here we have x power 4 plus y power 4 equal to 17 and second equation of this system x plus y equal to 1 x y belongs to real number. I will showcase two methods to solve this problem. So let me begin with method number 1 and I will write equation numbers first. So x power 4 plus y power 4 equal to 17 is our first equation and x plus y equal to 1 second equation. Now I will use algebraic identities in this method. So let me write equation 1 x power 4 plus y power 4 equal to 17. I can write x power 4 plus y power 4 as x square plus y square whole square. So x square whole square x power 4 y square whole square y power 4. What is extra? That is 2x square y square. So I have to take away. So 2x square y square equal to 17. Now again x square plus y square. So this bracket only. I can write it is x plus y whole square. So x square plus y square plus 2xy. So I have to compensate that 2xy by writing minus 2xy. Whole square would be as it is. Minus 2x square y square equal to 17. Now let's put the value of x plus y equal to 1. Equation number 2. So here I will write 1. So it will become 1 minus 2xy whole square. It is 1 square. So 1 square is 1. Minus 2x square y square equal to 17. Let's expand. So a minus b whole square. a square plus b square. So I will write 4x square y square minus 2ab. So I will write minus 4xy minus 2x square y square as it is equal to 17. So ultimately I will get 2x square y square minus 4xy minus 16 equal to 0. Equation is divisible by 2. So x square y square minus 2xy minus 8 equal to 0. So from this quadratic equation, I will find out xy because it is quadratic in xy. So I will write this equation again here. x square y square minus 2xy minus 8 equal to 0. So let us apply quadratic formula. It is quadratic in xy, so I will calculate xy equal to minus b. So 2 plus minus under the root b square minus 2 square is 4 minus 4ac, so plus 32 divided by 2a, so 2. I will write 2 plus minus, it is 6, square root 36 is 6. 2 plus 6 is 8 over 2, 4. 2 minus 6, minus 4 over 2, so minus 2. Now I will frame two system of equation. How it is? x plus y equal to 1 and xy is equal to 4 from first value of xy from this value. Now I will frame with minus 2 also. So I will write x plus y equal to 4. It is 1 and xy is equal to minus 2. Now we have to solve both the system for x and y value. So what we will do? The conventional method. I will calculate the value of y from the second one which would be 4 over x and I will substitute in first one. So this equation will become x plus 4 over x equal to 1. Multiply both sides with x and take all the term to one side. x square minus x plus 4 equal to 0. Let's apply Sridharachar formula minus b. So 1 plus minus under the root b square minus 4ac 16 over 2a. So we will write 1 plus minus square root of negative number complex solution i root 15 over 2 and this we will reject as solutions are complex. Complex solution. So I will write here rejected. Now let us consider second system, this one. So from second equation, I will write from this equation y is equal to 
minus 2 over x and let's put in this first equation so equation 1 will become the first one x plus y equal to 1 will become x minus 2 over x equal to 1 multiply both sides with x so x square minus x minus 2 equal to 0 apply quadratic or we can use factorization also let's apply quadratic formula Sridharachar formula minus b plus minus under the root b square minus 4ac divided by 2a so 1 plus minus root 9 that is 3 divided by 2 once I will consider plus sign in between, then 4 over 2, 2. Once I will consider minus sign in between, minus 2 over 2, minus 1. So x is 2 and x is minus 1. So we can find out y at the same time from this equation, x plus y equal to 1. So I can write y will be equal to, x plus y should be 1. So it is minus 1. 2 minus 1 is 1 and this is 2. So we have got final solution x to y minus 1 and x minus 1 y2. Ultimate solution for the given system of equation. Let us consider method number 2. Method number 2 I will use expansion method. See what I will do. This is our equation 1, equation 2. So let me calculate y value from equation 2. So I can write y is equal to 1 minus x. And this value I will substitute in 1. So x power 4 plus y power 4 equal to 17. I will write x power 4 plus y power 4. So 1 minus x whole power 4 equal to 17. Now if you will see power is 4. Either you can use 1 minus x whole square times 1 minus x whole square. Simply take the multiplication or using Pascal triangle 1 1 power is 4. So we need the coefficient for power 4. 1 2 1 power 2. 1 3 3 1 power 3. And 1 4 6 4 1 for power 4. Let me write this expansion using Pascal triangle. So x power 4 as it is plus. Now I will write. 1 minus c first coefficient expansion coefficient is 1 so i will write 1 minus then it is 4 times first power will decrease second power will increase alternate plus minus sign so i will write plus 6x square minus 4x cube then i will write minus or better is to write plus x power 4 you can see 1 4 6 4 1 alternate plus minus sign and see the power of x is decreasing as first term is 1 so no need to worry equal to 17 now i will simplify 2x power 4 then minus 4x cube then plus 6x square then minus 4x 1 minus 17 minus 16 equal to 0 equation is divisible by 2 so i will divide x power 4 it will be minus 2x cube then I will be writing 3x square minus 2x minus 8 equal to 0. Now I will use uh, rational root theorem or synthetic division method. So let me consider or let me find out the eligible factors of constant coefficient. So plus minus 1, plus minus 2, plus minus 4, plus minus 8. And leading coefficient, if you will see, it is plus minus 1. So I will take the ratio of that. Let me put x is equal to 2, suppose. So 2 power 4 is 16 minus 2 times 2 power 3, 2 power 4, 16 again. Then 2 square, 4 times 3, 12, minus 4, minus 8. Cancel these two. 12 minus 12, 0. Okay, so x equal to 2 is our base solution. Now I will use synthetic division method. Write all the coefficients of quartic equation. This is our quartic equation. I will write all the coefficient of this equation. Let me write here space. Okay, uh, 
coefficient of x power 4 is 1, coefficient of x cube is minus 2, coefficient of x square is 3, coefficient of x is minus 2, coefficient of constant term is minus 8. Let us put over there one line. Now first coefficient as it is 1. 2 times 1, 2, 0. 2 times 0, 0, 3. 3 times 2, 6, 4. 2 times 4, 8, 0. So here we are having coefficient for cubic equation. So cubic equation will become x cube. x square coefficient is 0. So I will escape that. 3x plus 4 equal to 0. This is our cubic equation. x cube plus 3x plus 4 equal to 0. Now let us solve this equation. I will use factorization method. x cube plus 3x plus 4 equal to 0. I will split our 3x term as 4x minus x. So x cube minus x plus 4x. I have split that one in this manner. Plus 4. Now from first two term you can see x is common. x is square minus 1. From last two term it is 4 common. x plus 1 equal to 0. Again I will use difference of two squares identity. a plus b. a minus b. Plus 4 times x plus 1 equal to 0. Take x plus 1 over all common. So I will write x times x minus 1 plus 4 equal to 0. x plus 1 times in bracket x square minus x plus 4 equal to 0. So from here conclusion is x is equal to minus 1 from first bracket. And now if you will solve this quadratic equation minus b plus minus b square minus 4ac divided by 2a solutions are complex valued so we will reject this why square root of negative number so we will reject this equation rejected as solutions are complex numbers so what is accepted that is x is equal to minus 1 now i will consider the first solution also that is x is equal to 2. So let me write here overall x values 2 and negative 1. Let's find out y value. So y will be 1 minus x. So y I will write 1 minus x. So 2 minus what I will write 1 minus 2. So minus 1 and 2. So same way. We can write our answer x equal to 2 and minus 1 and minus 1 and 2. Addition should be 1 always. So this is our accepted solution. I hope this video will be somewhere meaningful to you. Do not forget friends to like, share and subscribe. Bye bye till next video. Good luck and take care of yourself.